Good morning, FHS. This is the Daily Roar for Wednesday, September 26, 2012. Congratulations to the men's FHS AAA baseball team who defeated Leo Hayes 3-2 in the bottom of the seventh inning, giving Leo Hayes their first lose of the season. Nick Goodett pitched six innings and Adam Kerr pitched in relief to earn the victory. Ryan McGuigan scored the winning run. Any girls that would like to play hockey for the FHS girls hockey team this year should see Mr. Curry to get signed up. The FHS Lady Cats softball team defeated Leo Hayes 13-5. Jamie Ward reached base three times and had two stolen bases, and Megan Carson pitched an outstanding game rec recording a season-high 11 strikeouts. The Farsi boys soccer team dominated Leo Hayes on their home turf, frustrating the Lions team with a 3-0 win. Scoring for FHS were Clinton Doucette, Alex McNally, and Antonio Filipovic, while Cameron Ray posted the shutout. The Cats travel to Ecole St. Anne tomorrow for a game at 5. Come out and show your support. Reach for the Top will be holding Ford Drive One your, for Your School on Saturday, September 29th from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. in the F-Wing District parking lot. Come take a drive and have a bite at the barbecue. A car show will be held tonight from 6 to 9 p.m. in the Prospect Street parking lot. The FHS Auto Club will be having a fundraiser barbecue. Please come out and show your support. A study and go abroad fair is being held at the Halifax World Trading Convention Center on Sunday, September 30th. Students will be able to meet directly with top-ranked schools from around the world. For more information on what this expo has to offer, visit www.studyandgoabroad.com. There will be a table set up in the cafeteria at lunch on Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, selling yearbooks for $55. You can also buy online from the link on the FHS website. If you buy online before October 15th, personalization is free. Remember, yearbook sold out last year, so get yours soon. Students are reminded to use the student parking lot only. Students parked in other areas, including the district parking lot, may be towed at your expense. For students, students bringing their vehicles to school, you're reminded that you must purchase a parking permit from Constable Dix before the end of September. The cost is $5. You can pick them up during non-class time. There have been a number of thefts lately from both male and female locker rooms. Students are reminded to keep their belongings locked and to keep valuable items at home and not to steal. Representatives from Rotary International Student Exchange will be available to answer questions on their program this evening during the University and Colleges Fair from 4.45 to 6.30 p.m. Everyone is invited to come on out to the club extravaganza today at lunch. It's a great way to learn what's going on in our school. Make sure to visit the yoga table to find out how you can improve your flexibility and reduce your stress level for free. That's right. Our club will be meeting Thursday in Mr. Breen's room. Everyone is welcome. Free the Children will be holding their first meeting in C138, Mr. Prescott's room on Thursday, September 27th, at lunch. For all those that were interested in playing in the pit band for production, the music has finally arrived. Please see Mrs. Vermeersh to pick up your copy of the music sometime today in C38. Attention, all orchestra, orchestra. members, the after school practice today is canceled due to staff meetings. Our next rehearsal is on Monday at 12.30. Don't forget about our annual General meeting this Thursday at 5.15. Supper will be provided. Yum! The FHS Environmental Club meets every Wednesday at lunch in C50. Come out and help the cats go green. Attention Grade 9 students, if you are interested in getting involved in activities and events at FHS, come to C119 Mr. Peter's Room on Monday at lunch for information about applying to the Grade 9 representative on the SRC. The new representative will be chosen in October. The English Enrichment Club will have its first meeting on Thursday, September 28th in C50 at 12.30. All multicultural club members that plan on submitting a logo for the club need to have their logos to Mrs. Doucette by Friday, September 28th. I'm Sam Phillips. And I'm Kyle Kajari. And, and this, this has been, been The Daily, Daily Roar. Roar.